Radio on. Testing one two one two. Check one two one two. All systems go. Lift off in five, four, three, two, one. Welcome to the Alien T Podcast. Test out the audio real quick and make sure it sounds okay. Alright, no When you do that, I'm gonna open another can of Fanta. Alright, Cody, you say something now too, because Noah just said something. David Bowie. What? I don't David know. Bowie. That's not David Bowie. David Bowie. Didn't he make the Bowie knife? Are you mm. crazy? <laughs> My name is Kerr, and Kaiser Neko. Oh, no. Alright, I might put that in before the actual podcast begins. Let's see how that sounded. Bam! Right now. Hello, and welcome to the very first... That's right, folks. The very first podcast on the channel here. And... It's been a thing I've been wanting to do for some time now, but I've finally gotten some time and I've gotten the people that I wanted to do, well, most of the people, that is. We got two out of the original four that were supposed to be in it. Now, one of them isn't showing up at all, and the other guy's going to be on in the next segment because we kind of have a time crunch difficulty here. But let's just get to the topics here since we are running low on time as it is. Because of one of the people's schedule in the call right now. So I'm going to introduce him first. You guys probably have heard of this guy a lot. He's called Coldar505. Also known as Cody. One of my friends. Hello. Subscribe to me on YouTube. Of course. Of course he's got to selflessly plug himself. You know. Um, I am Kingflair5 as you know. Of course. Selfless plug. Yep. 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 And uh, I don't know my Twitter, but you can follow me on that. <laughs> I think it's just my name, right? Professional. Yes, professionalism at its best. <laughs> Indeed. And my other buddy here, he's actually been in a couple of my videos that never got uploaded on the channel, surprisingly. Well, one of them's for obvious reasons, because... <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Let's just say the premise was a man buys an apartment and he finds out there's whack job neighbors. And I'm not going to go any further than that. Oh, God. Oh, boy. <laughs> I want to see that video. It's never, it's, it's, it's never, it's never emerging. Don't even, don't even try, Cody. It's, no one's ever going to see, that video's never going to see the light of day. I'm sorry. 
<laughs> Why? Why don't you but put it in DVD? The one then? that has seen the, the actually, let's jump to that topic. Speaking of the the thing, actually, we didn't introduce yourself, but that is Noah, my friend Noah, and I wanted Hi. him to be. I, I got wanted... nothing to selflessly plug, so yeah. Uh. Ha ha ha! But anyways, speaking, let me get my topics out of my phone here. Oh God, my stupid. And I've got a few topics here. I'm going to save the first topic for last. For some reason, that, that was the topic that came to my mind first. <laughs> and it made me laugh so hard. But I'm saving that for last. But anyways, we're going to skip down to Haunted Insanity DVD. Now, we're also going to talk this about the other portion when we have Sean on. Because I want him to get a copy. And I'm also going to get Noah a copy. But Cody here... Has already gotten a copy, and Cody's can vouch for this. He said it was some great movies on there, and he actually enjoyed watching the one you were in, Noah. I was in one. Yeah, remember Killer 2.0 or whatever? Oh, good God! The one at uh, Kyle's house. Oh, good God! That <laughs> that got uploaded? No, it's on the DVD. <laughs> oh, okay, good. <laughs> That's pretty cool. You're a good actor, Noah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you are. I'm dealing with Kyle, so... No, 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 but they're... Just for it all being made up on the spot, Noah, that was a pretty genius plot that you made for that movie. Freaking genius plot. Genius. Like hella I genius. I know, I'm a genius. It yep. kind of reminds me of this one video that, that me and Quentin did at my birthday party where my brother had to kill, kill me and Quentin. Sort of like your character. Uh, was that, that put on YouTube? Uh, yeah. yep, it's still yeah. on my channel. I think I know what it is. I think I've seen it at least once. On Happy Birthday. Yep. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, Noah, this DVD is jam packed. I mean, jam packed with tons of features. Actually, I can read the case for you right now. Oh, it's even got a case. Oh yeah, hell yeah! I made a special case. Ready? This is the back, and you tell me if this isn't something you'd freaking pick off the shelves and take home. Ready? The first, the ting on the top says, Sometimes your life is worth less than your death. Dot, 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 dot. And then there's a paragraph here that talks about the main feature. And Noah, yeah, this, you get to see Cody is a skinny person in the main feature. It's a very rare sight to behold. <laughs> like, what? Cody is actually, like, not, like, really fat at all, like, Compared to my friend Brandon that you see in the movie, Cody actually looks com- extremely skinny. Like Cody skinny? Are you? Yeah, dude. High? <laughs> I'm, I'm serious. I've known Cody for a long time, and no, I've no, never no. seen him skinny. This is Cody back in seventh and eighth grade, man, dude. Oh, but dude. I've known Noah since seventh and eighth grade. You yeah. thought he was fat back then, compared to now? Well, not compared to now, but exactly. I mean, he he, that's considered skinny. He wasn't small. Uh, well, yeah, but he he, he was I mean, at he least dated help- a butch. <laughs> <It's amazing>. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that's funny. Can you explain to me again what a butch is? It's the ma- it's the more manly female in the lesbian partnership. <laughs> <laughs> Just so the viewers know, but what was I even talking about? Uh, lesbian uh, strongholds? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> No, no, oh crap! No, but Cody was a healthy fat back then. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a healthy fat. So was Sean. Sean apparently claimed that he was fat back then, but I don't. I don't see it. He was. He was not as fat as some other people. You know, like morbidly obese. I would say. I would say. Oh, speaking of that, never mind. I'm getting sidetracked. Super sidetracked. Uh, where was I? Oh yeah, here's the paragraph. There are people out there who will pay to have the pleasure of killing you. Four unknowing teenagers are about to be knocked out by a team of hired thugs and taken to an undisclosed location to be tortured and killed by a family of freaks. Once delivered, money is paid to those who capture the victims and the games begin the ultimate game of life and death. They will have to fight to survive and their experiences in this hell can only be described as haunted insanity. Now... Describe or de- like depending on what what you just heard. Would you would you watch that? I might. What? what? <laughs> oh, all right, all right. Here's how about this? What if the DVD included this? Right, this is also on the back. Special features. 
the full two, the full remaster 2010 unreleased Alien Team production, Haunted Insanity, outtakes and bloopers reel, a second disc complete with dozens of unreleased, did I just say unreleased? Yes, I just said unreleased Alien Team movies and shorts, including many rare and unfinished clips from the past, and much, much more. Da, 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 da. Yeah, there's one that's me failing as an assassin for Assassin's Creed. Oh, yeah, Assassin's Creed failure parkour, Noah. You gotta watch it. <laughs> oh, oh, man. <laughs> Cody oh, doing parkour. It doesn't make any sense at all. I know the freaking plot, man. Oh, God. <laughs> this will be good. Oh, God, Noah. Yeah, but I'll have to bring that over to your house one of these days. Drop it off to you. I'll have to get another one burnt. But, yes, that's the Haunted Insanity DVD, but... That's been something I've actually had a goal to give out to people for years, but now that I've actually figured out how to burn the DVDs properly, it's freaking epic, man. It's freaking hilarious. Like, oh my god, the amount of laughter you get from it, it's just like, oh my god, what in the hell were we thinking? <laughs> All I right. read that every day. <laughs> <laughs> no, but this is like a mega, like, facepalm, like, oh my god. Like, shaky cam beyond belief, like. Oh, shaky cam. Yeah. Josh in the movie. You should throw oh, no, in, uh, no. You should throw in like some hosting clips. Oh gosh. That's new stuff though. This is supposed to be classics. Alright. <clears throat> the next topic is uh ghost hunting for some reason. I don't remember why I put ghost hunting in here. I think I was talking about oh yes. This was, we were supposed to talk about that story about where you and Kyle were at my mom's house, but Kyle's not <laughs> even here. See? <laughs> because... Oh, man. Because Kyle... I didn't had him so bad. Kyle, Kyle, uh, didn't want to show up, so let's just talk about me and Cody's ghost hunting channel on YouTube. Oh, boy, I had Kyle so bad, though. I know. See, there's a lot of topics that we could talk about how you got Kyle with... <laughs> we could just we could just go on that and oh my god yeah but Cody's hours. Cody's running out of time see because <laughs> Cody's got we got like less than thirty minutes now because Cody's got to go to bed for work anyways uh work. ghost hunting work. so basically there's we got these EVP files and Noah and Kyle went down in the basement and Kyle freaked the hell out because you guys actually captured something or heard something fall and Kyle like almost started crying. I almost <laughs> shit his pants. Yeah. <laughs> what a whim. But like I did I, mean, think I could that... smell like groundhogging. <laughs> what the what? <laughs> <laughs> Oh god. I mean with that I did think the house was haunted because whatever it was woke me up at three in the morning blasting track one with Katy Perry's firework on my boom box. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Yep. yep. Katy Perry's you yep. put that on a CD? I don't, don't ask. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. But there no, was I'm a... going to ask. What the <laughs> hell were you thinking? I don't know why it was on there, dude. I don't know. But like, that was oh, track... this is a good song! <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> it's not as good as California Boys, the uh, parody oh, God. of California oh. Girl. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, oh, gosh. Boy. People, please go on YouTube and look up California Boys on YouTube and tell me. <laughs> tell me. <laughs> God, no. Uh, Cody's scarred from them old man. Old man. For your birthday when Kyle broke that plate? <laughs> oh, my God. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> but hold on, hold on, hold on. I got, I got this. I got this. Hold on. Uh, coming back to the other ghost hunting thing before we get too sidetracked here is actually um, me and Cody have a video on YouTube on a, on a channel called Alien Team Paranormal where we went to a playground and tried to do a paranormal investigation and it kind of didn't turn out too well because we didn't capture shit. But it okay. sounds like we did, though. <laughs> yeah, Cody, Cody's, one part. Cody is convinced that, okay, but I didn't, I didn't really, I, it was, I don't even know. There was probably nothing. But there was really a lot of wind interference and it was kind of crap. So, other what topics. About, huh? What about those... Those so-called orbs I caught over at Smith Park on my camera. Yeah, yeah, we didn't upload that one either, and you got really frustrated because we didn't capture anything on that one either. <laughs> All right, kind of a sidetrack thing here, but 
I was thinking about a lot of stuff for gaming in the podcast since I'm a gaming channel. So, is there any gaming news you guys would like to talk about? Half Life Three confirmed. Mm. Shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> Half Life Episode Three confirmed. How about that? How about uh? Shadow of Israel confirmed. Never. <laughs> that still pisses Sony me off. and Microsoft got hacked. Getting quote-unquote hacked by... PC Master Race, but we'll save that for when Sean gets here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about Sony getting hacked about the interview? Oh, yeah. Uh, I watched it anyways. Then I have a one called Gaming Hype, question mark. Is there any games you guys are looking forward to? Yes. Dragon Ball Z, Xenoverse. Oh. Halo 5 Guardians. Oh, yeah? Halo 5. Don't judge me, I'm a Halo nerd. You know what I'm looking forward to? Half-Life 3? <laughs> yes, I was just about to say that. <laughs> oh, God. What was that? What am I looking forward to? Freaking Fallout 4, if it ever comes out. Um, oh, yeah. They put that... Remember that? They, Bethesda, like, threw that in, like... Dude, that was a total to- troll. Deep Pe- storage or something like that. No, no. People were freaking going crazy over that website because they thought it was some Easter egg to it, and then it turned out to be some fan thing, and it was everyone Yeah, it's just a hoax. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The, the little Morse code Yeah, thing. like, yeah. Bethesda... When Bethesda started working on Skyrim, they just threw everything else into like deep storage and haven't pulled anything out. Right. <laughs> or the next Elder Scrolls game, but my friend Brad, you know Brad, or you know Cody, Brad, or uh, Cody, you know Brad, <laughs> right? You mean you mean Noah? No, Brad, the the one that's the one that's the brony. Yeah, that I we're know. Probably gonna have. Okay, we he's... all know Brad. Yeah. <laughs> we we. He said he claims that Elder Scrolls Online is going to Xbox One and it's going to be free to play on there. But I argued that I highly doubt that because if it's still going, to it be... might go to Xbox One, but it's not going to be free to play. Right, because he seems Unless, to think because you're going to have to buy gold. Mm-hmm. Right, but he's saying the subscription for Elder Scrolls Online is going to be free. But how can they do that if it's still going to be a cost-based thing on a uh, PC? That's a good question. Exactly. And I'm just buying an PC Xbox One games. because I want Halo. <laughs> I I kind of just want to get WWE 2K15, but I mean, just why would I buy the Xbox One just for that, really? Well, I'm gonna buy it for Halo because I'm gonna buy like the and most the of stuff is ported, but and... I really want to do the story Wait. mode and stuff on that. Really, all right. That was professional. Gaming, yeah, gaming hype is the section's over. So Half Life Three confirmed. Tell your friends. Tell your family. Uh, yeah. Tell everybody. Yeah. Tell Beth- make sure you tell Bethesda. Yeah, or not yeah. Bethesda. Um Derp. Tell Derp. Oh wow. <laughs> tell Derp. Yeah. Blank. <laughs> tell Tell Valve. Valve. Make sure, make tell, sure you tell Tell Gaben. Like, tell tell just, you just call him up and be like, yeah, Half Life Three confirmed. Suck oh it. yeah. Speaking of that, <laughs> Cody was actually gonna get into Counter Strike Global Offensive unboxings. Please try to okay. talk please try oh, to talk please. Cody down. Cody. Cody, if you do this, make sure you put every video online. <laughs> every Why? video. Uncut. Un- rage. Cut. This rage. I'm gonna pr- probably be like uh, Akutra. And it's gotta have face cams. Yep. Alright, next topic. Should I do that? Make make unboxing videos? Oh, Cody, speaking of unboxings... Cody, do speaking... you have that much money? I don't know. Okay, he has enough money to buy a loot crate every month, and that's actually a topic. You get loot crate? Yep. <laughs> yep. Well, I started to. Yeah, but it's a waste of money, Cody, I'm telling you. Okay, this is a uh, Batman Joker mix. Pop yeah, but you don't even like that kind of stuff. I do. Cool. So, Noah, what do you think about loot crate? Would you buy it? I want to, but I'm not 100% on that yet. Dude, it's a bunch of cr- junk crap, and you don't even get what you pay for Really, I, I'd rather like, um. What? You're, oh. der- you're derping again. Yeah, I know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> oh, it'll come to me. Don't worry about that. <laughs> I've been up since like four. Yeah, well, I don't know. I'm tired of staying up too late, but I have to. It's like I don't get enough sleep, and I'm tired of sleeping through the afternoon, but I need my sleep. Blah, blah, blah. So, next topic is. Take a bunch of NyQuil. <laughs> yeah, but then, OB I, on it. That, but then I'll be knocked out until 3 in the afternoon, and the whole point is I want to get up in the morning, but I still want to stay up late, so may, I wish there was like... There's a way to do it, you just gotta, it's just the pain. 
What, what's that? It, is that a really loud alarm? I know. I, I told no, you, Ace, hey, so you're still an it, idea. Put it across the room so you have to get up. Mm -hmm. But then I'll just and walk then, back to my bed. Nope. Nope. Got him. That's, that's where the self control comes in. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> and please elaborate. Nope. So. Control. That's all it takes. Really? And if I look up this self control on Google, will I get the results I need? You'll get. You maybe get. You might get like a dictionary. <laughs> oh God! I might. I might. It might want to give me the wrong kind of self-control advice, if you know what I mean. So, uh, so uh, last time I spent the night at your house, that that song woke me up, and I was wide awake. Yeah, but like I'm used to it. I just I'm so tired and pissed off that it woke me up that I just march right back to my bed and fall back asleep for another five hours. Cody, you should stay over there for a while. And then when it goes off, just keep punching him till he's awake. <laughs> hey, like, well, my don't hold back. Another thing about Brad, when he spent the night the one time, he kept just slamming me in the face with pillows. And then I th I hit him in the face one time with the pillow, and he freaks the hell out because I apparently almost broke his glasses. It's like, what the hell? You were <laughs> it, sounds like, it sounds like Swanson. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like, what the hell, man? You did that for ten minutes to try to wake me up, and now you get it one time, but... But anyway, what is what else is up with life with you guys? Anything up with li oh, bleh, anything else up with life? That's another next topic. Well, you know, there's Christmas. Yeah, but that's, a, that's the topic after that. But I mean, what else has been going on in life with you guys? Cody's uh, Cody Cody's been working at McDonald's, of course. You got fired from S. C. Johnson. I quit. There's a difference. Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I don't get unemployment. <laughs> I got I got to make stuff. Sorry. Uh, anything else to talk about with what is up with life? I I murdered fifteen people. Yep, I'm on Christmas or I'm on holiday break from college. I had a good You're first on semester. Tinder. Uh, I had a first good semester. I'm not he's on Tinder. On... Hey, lady, she's on Tinder. King Flair <laughs> Five. Who's? I don't have a Tinder, dude. He's on Tinder, ladies. <laughs> I'm on. Uh, I'm on. Uh, you're wasting time, and Cody's about to rage quit. <laughs> he's anyway. laughing over here. I know, but he said he's getting off right at 12.30 and he's going to rage if he doesn't. Anyways, so what is up with life? Like I said, I was on holiday break, but I go back to college soon, so all those videos you guys have been seeing on the channel, don't expect that to be a, a year-long thing from now on because I'm probably going to be super busy again, and then I'll be forced to watch Code, Cold R505's weekly videos to get through my hard life. Isn't that right? Weekly vlog, his, week, his daily vlogs and stuff like no, that. His daily vlogs and his his playthroughs that he does that make me laugh so hard because he rage quits on everything. That daily those, those daily vlogs that he posts on Facebook. Yeah. Oh god! Every time I see this, I'm like, nope. <laughs> <laughs> see, Cody, you already got a hater. <coughs> Haters gonna hate, hate, hate. Uh, I have like five of them. I'm gonna come over to your house and I'm gonna like. Bust in your door for singing that. <laughs> Taylor right, Swift so, is the devil. So speaking of holidays, what did we get for Christmas? Holidays and presents, blah 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 blah. I'm Jewish. That's, uh, yep, yep, and Hanukkah. Don't forget, and Kwanzaa, <laughs> and Kwanzaa out there for all you Kwanzaa people. Wow, that's really racist. No, it's not. I just said for all you Kwanzaa people. All right, all right. What'd you guys get? Um. I got a packet of underwear. What? No, Cody. I, bro, I'm bro, I'm that's amazing. I'm talking. Hey, now you don't have to buy it. <laughs> got two packs of socks. Oh, God, he's just too... <laughs> Pack of colored pencils. Oh, my goodness. You get anything uh, Drawing good? paper. Axe spray and axe shampoo. Well, and $100. Going by you. You should have led with the hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, dude. All those little things. It's like not even relevant. Who who cares about socks? We got socks for Christmas. What kind of underwear, Cody? Um, briefs. I think both. Oh boy. You only got a package. Yep, just one. So it's oh, a boxers or briefs. I don't know. I think there's like a combo of them. Are they some... super loose or are they? Firm and tight. I, th I think there's like one super loose and the rest are all like firm and tight. I haven't looked at it lately. Oh, goodness. What? Is it still in the package? Yeah. By the way, Cody, you gotta put out that poster in your room. 
or the thing. I know. I want to see that in the vlog. Plus, I got this other one I want, I got for you. What is it? It's a present. <laughs> so you're gonna have to come and get that. Ha <laughs> ha. I got. Unless Christmas. Noah wants it, Noah okay. will probably happily take it off your hands. What is it? It's a present. <laughs> <laughs> What kind of poster is it? Uh, how'd you know it's a poster? I kind of gave it away, didn't I? Shit. So I yeah, you just yeah. said that it was a poster. It's a Walking Dead poster. Okay, you can keep it. You don't want it? <laughs> nope. It's got Rick and Daryl on it. I'm sure Cody wants it. It's really epic looking. Cody can have it. Oh my goodness. Alright, what else we got on, uh, on here? Basically, that's most of my topics. Oh, wait, wait, we got one right here. This is Cody, and I can explain this really well to you, Noah. So, Noah, do you know why this is going to be a rare moment? So anyone that's wondered what Alien Team Productions is, they're going to have to go to this part of the timeline in the podcast to find this out. So, Noah, do you know what Alien Team stands for, what its meaning is, or what AT is, or Alien Team Productions, what was the origins? So, this topic is the origins of AT. I Ooh, thought I you guys were just a bunch of, like, illegal aliens from, like, Canada or something. <laughs> that's the first thing that comes to mind for it? Well, I don't think little green men, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> that's just, well, not. I think that either I think it, Canadians or Mexicans. <laughs> No. And green cards. <laughs> green card. Oh my god. Does that make me a racist? Probably. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't even know. And anymore. if it does, I don't care. So basically, this act, the origins of it start in kindergarten, believe it or not. Good god, Cody, you were small? <laughs> believe it or not. You? Yep. I don't know where it got inspired from, but me and Cody used to play this imaginary game. Where I would act like I was these bosses. It must be because I used to watch him play Zelda and Mario games so much over at his house. But, like, for some reason, we would, like, reenact these battles and stuff. And it would probably be really st stupid to see, like, in third person or out of person. I don't even know how we reenacted it. Because we didn't know, like, I don't know. But, like, basically, the whole premise, I don't know. It was crazy. I don't even remember the whole premise. But there was, like, aliens attacking Earth and it had to be saved or some crap. And, like, ever since then, I guess, like... Like, once I created my YouTube channel, obviously, we made our channels, Cold Dark 505 and King Fire 5, but when I wanted to have, like, a production name for my videos, I was like, hmm, I need, I wanted to have, like, uh, I wanted to be, like, uh, not parentheses, what am I thinking? Like, like, abbreviation, or something like that, and I was like, alright, let's just use Alien Team from, like, the olden days when we were kids, and I don't even remember, but if, I like, I like, it fits well, I feel, like, Alien Team, but... Well, yeah, you, you guys are fucking weird. Yeah, but what do you, Cody? What do you remember from Alien Team, like back in the day? Um, I remember I... there was like a King of the Grim Reapers boss. There was a Pumpkin King boss, and for some reason, the King of the Lava Grim Golem. Yeah, the King of the Grim Reapers lived inside the radiator heater in the kindergarten class for some reason. Like that was his house where he lived. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh, and there, there's He's like, I like it too. And then there was this dinosaur that I always reenacted and played as. That was like one of them weird, like, Gal Galilemus dinosaurs or whatever. The long necked, weird, fast runner ones. And I would always say, I say, blah, 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 blah. And I don't remember the origins of that. From Gex. Gex. Gex 3. Oh, yeah, that's what that you told me about. That one with the secret agent lizard guy. Oh, my goodness. Please, Cody, elaborate on how you know this offhand. <laughs> yeah. I used to play the game, and I still have it. Yeah, so that must have been when I got that from, gosh. Because I don't think I played much video games as a kid. Because I remember I had this game called Torak Rage Wars, and I was scared to even leave the spawn room. Because it, <laughs> it was, like, scary. And then Cody would leave the room whenever I played Castlevania 64. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was so scared of that game. <laughs> I think the first game I ever played was, like... Goldeneye on the 64. Oh my god, I remember my cousin Colin used to troll me so hard and I ended up crying because I always used to think he was on my team and I don't know what I didn't get about it because he kept killing me, but I, he was always wanting me to meet up with him and then he'd either shoot me in the face or he'd put those like <laughs> laser mines down and have me walk towards him and then blow up and then he'd laugh at me and I remember I cried and he tried to offer me like a Lego dragon in exchange for me to not tell his parents of how terrible of a babysitter he was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd go over because I didn't I had, like, a Sega Genesis, mm -hmm. but I didn't really get it. Like, I didn't like the controller. 
Uh, so I'd go across the street to my friend's house. I remember they we... had a Sega Genesis at my daycare, and they'd always play that freaking Sonic games. Oh, God. But every day, it's like they would face the same boss as that freaking Eggman boss and stuff. It was like, oh, my God, could they never have a save or anything? Oh, it was terrible. terrible. Oh, uh, speaking of... I'd go over Bastards. there, and we'd just play, like, N64. It was all oh, great. Oh, my God. It was the best. Yeah. N64 was the, was awesome. I, I want to buy an N64. I have two of them. But one of them's missing yeah, some but I, cords. Remember, I want to buy, uh, like, a... Oh, yeah, another thing me and Brad prayed was uh, Rampage World Tour or whatever. Remember that game? Rampage 2, Cody? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. And then that we played uh, San Francisco Rush. That. Oh my goodness, I love San Francisco mm-hmm. Rush. And then we played some good old Star Fox sixty four, and he Brad got all mad oh, at me because I was owning him at at the game that he he loves, and his he was like, I was like, am I stirring up bad memories with your brother? Because he mentioned that him and his brother used to play, and he'd get really ticked off because I was winning each time. Is this Brony Brad? <laughs> yeah, this guy you haven't met, but you should meet him. He's freaking hilarious. Oh god, oh, wait, Brony. No. No, you Brad. did meet him. What the frick? I'm a derp. We're in cruise center together with yeah, him. Yeah, I'm yeah. a derp. I'm sorry. I'm a freaking derp. You know Brad. What, what am I kidding? Yeah. Uh, but anyways, what were you going to continue about bosses or something, something about the origins of Alien Team? Because we're getting way sidetracked. <laughs> um, no idea. Do you know those those little play- playground things with the ball? It's like you throw throw the ball up and it goes down like you know like three different holes and it's like a little game oh yeah um, it's like on a pole yeah and it has like four or three different holes you gotta choose from to see when the ball comes out yeah and you get points mm-hmm. yeah but we had this this boss from Mario Bowser in it and we mm-hmm. had a like throw the ball Ball in the the hole, and wherever the he was r- running by the hole, if the ball came out, then he he got a hit. Oh yeah, I remember that was fun. But I remember I always used to get ticked off because you actually played basketball back then, and instead of doing the boss battles and play with me, you'd play with the basketballs and stuff. And I remember I always got ticked off and stuff because <laughs> I wanted you to play. I was like, play Alien Team, don't play a stupid. Uh... Don't play a real sport. Yeah, <laughs> just play imagination. <laughs> By the way, Noah, speaking of crazy sports, me and Cody actually were going to go LARPing before. Oh, boy. <laughs> me, and Cody actually have, <laughs> me and Cody actually have LARPing stuff, believe it or not. I have chain mail, and I have LARPing shield and a LARPing sword, and Cody has a LARPing mace, and I want Cody to go as a dwarf, and I'm going to go as I a Templar. To, I used to make LARPing swords. Really? The foam boffers or whatever? Yeah. Yeah. Oh I used to have, like, 15 or 20 of them. Really? Yeah. Oh, well. Never you had need... shields or anything like you that. You should but... donate them to our Bay City LARPing thing. Our Facebook I said page. I used to. No, but you should donate to them, because we have a Facebook page called Bay City LARPing, Br- or, uh, Noah. Oh, like, <laughs> you want money? No, we want you to donate those all those boffers. <laughs> They're gone. They, they know, were destroyed. I know, but I'm just saying. I'm just saying. If you did have them. Okay, I'll make some more. <laughs> no. No, because the guy that we actually started. I would be happy. Yeah, but like the guy, there's this one guy that wanted us to get into it, and he's basically took us under his wing to do his own like crazy ass rules and stuff. But I, I it's mean, like 50 years old. Yeah, and he's got two kids <laughs> and stuff, but like we went over to his house to like practice LARPing, and he's like a fencing expert, and he totally owned us. And he said that Cody was a better LARPing fighter than I was, and I got really mad at that. Like, how in the hell is Cody better at sword fighting than me? Impossible. Oh, God. But. Maybe yeah. he just saw how insecure Cody is. and <laughs> It's just life or death situation every time. I don't know. But I don't know. That kind of fell yeah, away. Cody's like, if I lose, I die. Yeah, but that's like one <laughs> it just random. Kicks ass. <laughs> yeah. That's just like one thing. And he was probably just really uncomfortable in that situation because he basically told me straight up that he didn't want to do the LARPing. And I was like, I thought you were excited for this. So basically, he wasted all that money on LARPing shit for nothing. But I guess they're still props now. I guess. And another sport I wanted to get into, but I'm kind of falling away from that, which I also wasted a lot of money on, was airsoft because I wanted to go to these mill sim things. But who knows? Maybe I'll still go to those and go to the airsoft fields. That still sounds like fun, I guess. We should, 
We should just get a bunch of airsoft guns, and the next time we see Kyle, just pelt him. <laughs> like, here's what you get for not showing up for the podcast. <laughs> oh, did um, did Br- Brad s- s- sit on your floor the whole time looking at your airsoft guns? Yeah, he freaking kept playing with the airsoft guns. It was annoying as hell. Like, he would not put them down. He's obsessed with them. And then he's, like, t- looking up all these, like, guns that he used to get and all this stuff. I'm like, oh, my God, stop, stop. He created a monster. But speaking, going back on Kyle and stuff, this is the final topic, and I want to get both of your guys' reaction. I'm just going to say two words, and this is the first thing I thought of. But we're going to talk a, a little bit. The little time we have left, we're going to talk about this hilarious topic. You guys ready for this? I guess. All right. Two, I got, I've only got two words for you. Lemon party. Oh god. Oh. oh, oh. <laughs> I had oh my to. God. I That's, had to. The site is disgusting. <laughs> I oh trolled. God. I've trolled Cody about three or four times because he kept forgetting. I couldn't believe I got Kyle to look it up. <laughs> no, but Noah, you gotta tell the origins about Lemon Party because I had no clue what it is, and I swear to God, I have trolled like thirty people, over thirty people with this website thanks to you showing it to me because people are like what's this and i have them click on it and they're like, oh my god i'm getting their live reactions it's the okay. greatest thing dude oh okay. my god you see you want the origins of how i found it i remember you called some guy that worked at 7-eleven you wanted to know what the name of the website was because he couldn't figure it out properly and we wanted to, was it the same time that we actually wanted to troll kyle with it and that's basically yeah. how the plate broke incident happened or no, no, that yeah. was a screwdriver thing, but that's totally... Oh, <laughs> that's totally oh, irrelevant. Oh, oh, oh. But first, okay. first let's talk lemon party. Okay, so... When I was living... When I first got, like, my laptop, my first laptop, mm-hmm. I was, uh... Curious. I was home alone for... Fuck you, Cody. <laughs> I was home alone, <laughs> and... My brother Tim, the guy I called. Oh yeah, that guy, dude. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, he, was he came over to check on me. Uh-huh. Like because I was like fourteen, fifteen. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, it's probably thanks to us that that website's even still up because of the traffic we're giving him. Because if it was around back then. Yeah. And he he comes. He's like, oh here, and he just takes my laptop, types it in, presses enter. And my internet was still pr- my internet was slow enough at the time where he could spin it away mm-hmm. without having to look at it. <laughs> and it was, oh my god! Oh my god dude. <laughs> I almost threw just up. Just that picture in the center, and it's just so ghetto. It's just like people like if the page loads in slow, and they're like, "What the hell is this?" <laughs> yeah. And so I was like, "Okay." And then when we were over there, when we were all over at your mom's house. Oh yeah, those good like, times. I was like, this is the perfect time, because you're, that computer was so slow. <laughs> I know. It was so ghetto I so mean, it bad. couldn't even load a video. <laughs> Dude, it was uh, having a hard time freaking doing, like, what, what, it did was, it, what could it not load? Like, what was the hilarious thing that it couldn't even do? Like... I don't remember, dude, but they're like, was that during my birthday party, or what was that? Yeah, I think so. I don't remember exactly, but I remember like, Kyle's reaction. But, You're like, oh my god, what are you making me look up? And we literally made him sit down in that chair. We, like, and he was we freaking like, out. Force held, we, like, held him down, and we and I, we hit enter, and we and hold him just, there for, like, he a looked minute. At it, he looked at it for, like, a straight face at the first, and he's like, he's like, Oh, oh. <laughs> he, just, he just starts busting out laughing, dude. It was like, it's like, it was a mix of like, it was a mix of confusion, d- deceit, and like, I don't I don't know how to explain it, but Kyle like got, like, it was like, he was defiled, or it was, he was like, uh, what was the word? Like, freaking, I don't know. But it was freaking hilarious, dude. And then, uh... Was Tim there too? I think Tim was there too. Yeah. That was the time that I ate that whole thing of cookies, right? <laughs> oh my god. And you guys made cookies. And you gave this. me you gave me the plate, right? And uh You came over and grabbed the plate. <laughs> really? You guys had it sitting down. I don't even think you guys hardly had any. I told you guys to make cookies and I was dead asleep. And you guys got them done and basically I somehow woke up and ate the entire plate of cookies and went straight back to sleep while you guys were watching that movie. <laughs> That was. I think that was the time we did the cinnamon challenge too. Oh my god, that, that was, was a hilarious. big spoon. That was, spoon was. But basically, huge. the time that uh, I think it was the time that Kyle was there too. We made him look up that freaking 
that freaking screwdriver video, and that's when he tried, after that, he wanted to push me towards it, and basically that plate broke, and he freaked out, yeah. and it was a big mess, but, like, basically, you and him got into a fight, remember? He kept hitting me, and I'm like, what What are you doing? Yeah, oh my god, <laughs> hit me in the ear, like, a couple times, and I'm like... Oh you my god, it was funny, because you just, ear? all you did was slam him up against a wall, and he was, like, crushed. <laughs> he had nowhere <laughs> to go. Oh my gosh, it was crazy. Then I ended up fixing that plate, mostly. But yeah, I knew I'd get a reaction out of you guys for Lemon Party. Good old Lemon Party. It's been oh, a tradition good. to troll people on Skype with it and stuff. I'll randomly send it to people. Like, what what I do, like, when I send it to people, I put it in, like, a, um, like a URL shortener. Mm-hmm. Oh, and yeah. That, like... <laughs> no, but, like, if I send it to Kyle nowadays, he's just like, no, no. And I'm like, come on, dude, it's a good sight. Because <laughs> he's, should... I, st I still harass him with it to this day. You should send him, you should send him, like, a URL shortener. <laughs> so it's like a, like, a, it's like a, it's like a bit dot whatever. Oh, my gosh, how do I get that? I'm going to do it to him right you now. You just, just, uh, like, look up URL shortener or whatever, URL. and you just, and you just take the... Uh, URL, put it in, and it shortens it into a code, and... Oh my gosh, here it is. <laughs> here we okay. go, you guys want to get his live reaction? What was it? Lemonparty.org? Yeah. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> so how are we going to get his live reaction? No, I'm just going to tell you what he says, like on okay. Skype or Steam. Okay, I'm oh good with that. Oh, oh god! <laughs> oh. I had to look at it for a second. Oh god. Please, viewers, oh. do not go to that link. Oh, God. You didn't have to, like, copy and paste. You could just type it in. Oh, yeah. Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't have to go to the website. Oh, God, I actually see the picture, though. <laughs> dude, that website is such a troll, though, dude. I'm not even joking. Like... It's not like, like it doesn't. There's nothing on it that works. No, it's not that. It's like, it, of course you could send some like crazy and weird porn thing, but it's just the site itself. It's just pure gold. Yeah. Oh god, I'm sending it to him. Ready? Uh, over Steam. Here we go. I just sent it. Oh my god. Let's see what if he clicks on it. He's gonna probably not look at it because he's probably too busy playing Black Ops Zombies. Yeah. I'm yeah. a way. No, now he's playing Men of War Assault Squad. Oh god. Gay. But here's <laughs> here's a link shortened. Here's a shortened link. Do you do you guys have anyone you can send it to real quick? <laughs> yeah, I can send it to anybody. Oh god. Uh, let me see here. Here's the shortened link. <laughs> here you go, Noah. Have fun with it. Oh god. But guys. Where's? This will be segment one of the Alien Team podcast, and later on tonight, if it's still going to happen, we are going to have another guest on the podcast, and we're going to talk a little bit more about stuff. But for right now, we're going to say goodbye to our good friend here, Cody, also known as Coldart505. Um, make sure you check YouTube out... YouTube.com slash user Coldart505. Yep, yep. Hey, Cody. Plug. Make sure you check out his channel. Bye. Uh, hold on. Oh, God. Oh, my <laughs> there we go. channel link. And then just... Nate always sends you those weird pictures, too, Cody. Remember those? Aren't you scarred oh, for life for some of those? Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> don't, don't remind me, please. <laughs> hey, Cody, you should check your messages. Um, no. <laughs> oh, God. I just, I just sent a little link. Yeah, to what? Something that I'm gonna I don't send want it to. to I'm going to send it to Nathan, too. <laughs> right now, once he goes to it. Should I send it to my girlfriend? Oh, God, yeah. Do it. No, that's a bad idea. You have a girlfriend? No, I didn't know. Yeah. Who, where is she from? Is she, I hope she isn't from Thailand. <laughs> well, no, she's from Michigan. And, you know, Bay City. Apparently Kyle's going to actually meet that girl. I don't know how the hell that's going to work out. Wait, are they just talking, like, online? They met online, basically. And, like, I wasn't talking to Sean for like, How a couple you... months, and he randomly texted me, because even Sean didn't believe that that was his girlfriend. Sean's like... Yeah, he's... he sends me he sends me a text, or a Snapchat, out of the blue. Yeah, I know. And I'm like, what? The what? Heck? And he's like, 
because I, I talk to him on like a daily basis, but it's like after work, he sends it's like in the middle of the day, and I'm like, what is this? And I read it, and I'm like, what are you? Yeah. I thought he was lying. Yeah, like it was. He hasn't texted me in so long. <laughs> Basically, he had a new number, so I was like, "Who is this?" And he's like, "Sean." I'm like, "Oh, I didn't even realize." But he's like, "It was that important that he had to know, like, if it was a legitimate thing." But you can ask Kyle. It is. <laughs> he apparently they are going out. Yeah, I checked. I checked. It's Facebook official and everything and now. Apparently, she has she's, a Facebook apparently now. she's gonna come to America and everything. So. When, that's, wow. that's what you like, got to do, Cody. You got to go overseas and get yourself a girl. Get, get that, get that yeah. Thailand putang. <laughs> oh God! Come on, we got to keep this freaking podcast family friendly here. <laughs> Come on now. You've been boy. swearing. Cody's been swearing. Cody never swears. Are you kidding me? He's a ginger. I don't know if that has to do with anything. No, it doesn't. He, swear, he Cody, swears when it comes to holsing. Can you confirm that if you have a soul or not? Yes. Oh God. So you do have it, or you I, don't have one? I have one. Are you sure? Yeah, because I wouldn't be alive if I didn't have one. But oh, how do you know? Oh soul, soul isn't like a heart. Soul is like some afterlife thing. I don't know. Cody, Cody, nothing has been proven scientifically that a soul even exists. Yeah. So soul is you. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. So, Cody, like I was saying, we're going to leave the thing, but if they want to check out your channel, what kind of stuff do you do there? Um, all sorts of stuff. I do He, he streams gay porn. Yep. Cowboy That's all. Butt sex. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Broke back mountain in this bitch. Yeah. Oh, God. No, I do gaming videos, and I have a little web series going on right now called The Holders. Yeah, and you get to see me and Cody blast uh, freaking energy balls at each other. You guys should watch the first the first season or whatever. Oh of the whole... god, dude, it's so ghetto. <laughs> Made with Pinnacle Studios 12. Oh my goodness. <laughs> now we upgraded to After Effects, but Cody does gameplay and he does lots of playthroughs. Something that I do not too much of on my channel. But go check him out for playthroughs and stuff, and also check out the videos of games that I suggest him to play because he rages hardcore whenever I suggest him a game to play. It's pretty funny. Cody, yeah. you should do Hitman Blood Money. I don't know if Cody's ever played him. No, I don't. And Cody, where the, Cody, hell, where the hell are the you'll Christmas hate yourself. specials? Like, literally, it's way past Christmas. It wasn't a Christmas special for me. No, but, like, seriously, they're, they're Christmas-inspired maps, and I already have mine all, all mine up. Where are the ones you're supposed to put up? Exactly. Rendering one. on Time Warner Cable. <laughs> yep. Time Warner. Yeah, yeah. All right, but this concludes the first segment. Um, if we don't end up doing a second segment, which I highly doubt we won't, but we probably will, and blah, 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 blah. I wish everyone a Happy New Year, because this is probably going to go up after New Year's. Not sure how well my scheduling is going to go, but there's going to be a date that will tell you what day this was recorded on. Well, basically, this is going to be recorded over two days, because it's the 27th right now. But uh, we will now say goodbye to Cody, and we will uh, lead out in song. Noah, what will we sing to Cody? Uh, booty, 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 rocking everywhere. Oh, no, 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 no. Rocking everywhere. No, 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 no. In, in uh, essence of the DVD, Cody, remember that little instance where you're twerking and I put a song in there? Don't ask. There's a movie we made, but for some reason Cody decided to twerk and I decided to remix that what? little clip. <laughs> yeah. What movie is that? Remember the Paranormal Possession one? And at the end when the door shuts, you do that weird thing. And I was like, again, <laughs> guess you know what song that is. Really, you guys don't know? Don't what? Oh my god, hold on. I'm, I'm going to play a little preview. Hi? I'm going to play a little preview. No, this is the song that I remixed, okay? Stupid ads. Really? Oh, wait, you can't hear it. Never mind. Let's just say it's a little song by Jay-Z and Kanye West. Oh, God, Kanye. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, well. Well, anyways, guys, uh, we will see you in the second segment if there is one. Um, and this has been the Alien Team Podcast, Episode 1. If you want more with new people because I'm probably I have a few people lined up that I usually would want to put in the podcast but this will be episode one for now so anything else you want to say Cody before I end off this segment 
Uh, yes. Alrighty. Got a time splitter playthrough going on pretty soon here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've you already had your chance, okay, dude. Cody, you're stop still, it. <laughs> you're stuck. Jesus. Follow me on Twitter at Cody Strose. Yep, yep, yep. Friend me. Send me a friend request on PSN, the yep, Bat Jew, yep. all lowercase. Selfless plug. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, uh, add the Fat Jew pimp on Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> Boom shakalaka. <laughs> and uh, make sure you uh, like the video. And um, for anyone that knows that they're going to be in a future episode of the podcast... Just so, uh, so you know, this is how the layout goes. So basically, at the beginning, blah, 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 social networking, blah, 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 blah. But we can explain it if you ever want to be on it. So, Cody, have any last words? Um, I swear to God, if you plug yourself one more time, I know where you live. <laughs> no, you don't. Cody, you live by Elro. I can show where you where Cody lives. I'll pick up Noah and drive him to your house and make Noah, like, come in your house. I, I know where he is. <laughs> Oh, God, I'm scared. You should just be a stalker on his blogs and find out everything about him. Okay. <laughs> okay, I quit. I said, I sent Tra- Travis that link. He said, what is that? What is, what is, oh, God, what is he going to say? <laughs> just, okay, just say click on it, dude. <laughs> okay, I did. What did he say? I don't know yet. He has a response. Oh, God. Dude, his dad's a cop. What if that's his dad? Oh god! <laughs> oh my goodness! I want to get the reaction. It's not illegal. <laughs> Wait, how old is Travis? What do you say? Nothing yet. How old is Travis? He's gonna be in my podcast. He's a bit younger. I met him on uh, Arma Two game, but he lives over in uh, where is it? Freaking, where does he live? It's over by kind of by Grand Rapids. Freaking. Is he under 18? Yeah. Yep. Yep. Oh, then it is illegal. <laughs> oh, God. what do he say? Nothing yet. <laughs> He's silent. Oh, my goodness. And then I'll add him to the call once and get his reaction. <laughs> and he can be at the end of the uh, segment one of the podcast. Did he say anything? No, not yet. He's probably not going to click on it. He's probably gotten this before. Oh, my goodness. He probably thinks it's a Rick Roll. <laughs> no, I've trolled him with it before. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. That's freaking hilarious. <laughs> Anything yet? No. Nope. But yes, Noah, I want to be there when you watch it and get your live reaction to the DVD, so... You'll have to let me know when you got a... Oh, yeah, you don't work, so you probably always got days off, don't you? Not all the time. All right, well, I'll have to text you sometime and see when I could come over, because I think I remember where you live based on the graduation party. Okay, good. Yeah. Did he say anything yet, Cody? No. No. Oh. Darn it, darn it, darn it. I was hoping I'd get in the podcast, but I feel like I'm just dragging on the segment now. <laughs> Uriah has a birthday today. Really? Uriah ages? <laughs> really, no. That's surprising. It is. Noah, uh, I see your other account. Should I add him to this group call? I won't answer. Because <laughs> it's connected to my phone. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah, you also get to see a movie where I'm like a little tiny whacked out clown in the DVD. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and you get to see Cody where he forgets his lines, and his famous line is, Good old Captain Morgan. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to watch it to find out. This is Cody, lines. are you alcoholic? No. There was hesitation. <laughs> but uh, you can also check out Noah's videos. He has a video of himself uh, taking his shirt off and spinning it around, right? Is that still up there? Yeah, uh, Applesauce Productions. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Got one God. video, it's called Sexy Strip Tease. Oh, oh, oh my God. <laughs> Don't look up Sexy Strip Tease, because you won't find the right one. <laughs> oh, only got one video. Oh, my gosh, Cody, doesn't... remember back in the olden days of YouTube where you had all these weird videos in a playlist of all these girls, like, stripping and stuff? And I was like, what in the hell? Why do you have all these? How did you Wait, have these on YouTube? What? Cody, what? you had that? No, this I... is like... 
This is back in the golden days of YouTube, right? Where, like, everything... You know how YouTube had, like, the banners for partners and all that? It was, like, way back. Like, yeah. Back in 09 like and the, stuff. the five-star rating system? Yeah, and stuff. Like, Cody had this playlist of all this crazy stuff that, like, YouTube would have flagged in an instant nowadays. I did? Yeah, remember? No. Yeah, you were, like, over oh, at my mom's Cody house. Cody just shut that part of his life out. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dark, dark place, man. Oh, God. All right, well, I need to get going. All right, guys, so this is the end of this segment. I hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you in the next part if there is one. Goodbye! Do you want to close them out with your famous goodbye, Cody? Oh, goodbye. Whoa, that was perfect. Yeah.